Good morning. I didn't know you were up already. No, I just I just woke up too. Like maybe five minutes ago. I just like brushed my teeth and basically you woke up. I don't know, I feel like a zombie this morning, honestly. Like I'm so tired. And I'm like stiff too, you know. Um, I was just gonna make some coffee because I'm um, like I said, literal zombie. You want some? Okay. Um, I don't, I don't know if we're gonna have enough though. I'll have to check. Um, yeah, um, there's not even enough fucking coffee here for me to have any. <clears throat> and you gotta go in at what? What time? 7.30 you have to leave? Oh, that's so fucking lame. Do you have to go? Like, couldn't you just, like, stay here with me today? Like, what if you called in sick? Oh, yeah, that's true, hey. But just tell them, like, it's not, like, COVID. It's not COVID. I'm sick, but it's not COVID. <laughs> I don't know. I'm sure we can figure something out though, right? Like, this is like the last day I'm off until like, like almost next Monday. So like, you should totally just spend the day with me. Well, yeah, like, the house is so fucking boring without you here. There's nothing to do. You know, you know what we could do? What if... Um... Okay, okay. I got it, I got it. Okay. What if you... What if you call your boss, right? And tell him that your car broke down, Right? And uh, like, will make me sound like the hero of this story, right? Okay, and then you can tell him that your boyfriend uh, went to get stuff to fix it, but you don't know how long it's gonna take. And then, boom, like excuse, like that's, he's not even gonna question that. No way. Yeah, it, no, it'll work. So, okay, that's what we'll do. And then, you know what? We can go, we can go walk, and go get some coffee. Yeah, and then it'll be, it'll be a good way for me to work off my stiffness. It's partly your fault anyway, because you're a fucking bed hog. You guys have all those stupid fucking pillows all over the place too. <laughs> no, it's not, it's not that I don't like the pillows, it's just that, do, do we have to keep them on the bed at night? Because <laughs> they, they kind of get in the way. They get in the way all the time, actually. <laughs> any any bed oriented activities that we're trying to do, that shit is always in the way. And you know what? You know it's true. And it is what it is. I guess I'll leave it at that because I know I'm never going to win this discussion. Okay. Um, okay, call your boss. And give him the sob story, and I'm gonna go take the garbage out. Yeah, I've... Look, okay, I got home late last night, alright? And I didn't want to drag the trash cans out there in the pitch black. So I figured I'd just do it when I got up this morning. I don't, they shouldn't be here for like at least another five minutes. I got time. Okay. Alright, I'll see you in like five minutes. Okay, well, okay, rendezvous back here in five minutes. Okay, I love you.
can't believe this shit. <clears throat> no, I was halfway down the driveway, right? Was halfway down the driveway with the trash can in my hand. I was taking it down there. And these motherfuckers, they're driving, right? I see them. I And I'm like, okay, sure that they're going to stop, right? And guess what they didn't do? They didn't fucking stop. So here I am running halfway down. I went through a whole ordeal. It was... It was bad. Like, I was running down the driveway with the trash can in my hand, yelling at them. I'm like, stop, stop. <laughs> Wait, you drive past me. I, I just... I'm low-key kind of mad about that. I'm not going to lie. I, I was not planning on running this morning. Not with how stiff I am. Anyway, um, did, uh, your boss, like, do you believe it? Mm-hmm. Mm hmm Okay. So, we're, we're good then, right? That's what that means? Okay. Well, what do you say? Uh, you can get your coat, and, uh, we'll head out on our adventure, okay? Okay, grab your coat, and let's go. Okay, you ready? Alright, let's get going then. Just lock that door quickly. We don't want our house to get broken into and robbed, right? Not that like that's gonna happen here, but <laughs> it doesn't hurt to be safe, right? So, what are you gonna get? Hmm. Yeah, I'm thinking like an extra large coffee for sure. I'm gonna need something to last me for a while. And you know, I mean, you know me. Like, I'm not the biggest, like, donut guy, but shit, you know. Honestly, I might get like a donut or something with my coffee this morning. Yeah, fuck it, why not? This day is like already out of the ordinary for us, so why not, right? <laughs> Honestly, I'm kind of surprised your boss let you off that easily. Yeah, well, in the past, he's like been a, like a dickhead, you know? Like, remember that one time he made you come in during a snowstorm? Like, that was fucking ridiculous. You know? I don't know if I've ever told you this before, but you know one of my favorite things about living in like this like city is not only is it very nice, but I don't know, like I like the idea that there's always stuff going on, you know? It kind of like makes me feel at ease in a way. Like when you hear the ambulance sirens or you know, cars driving past or people in the distance, it's like it's, um, it makes you feel not as small, I guess. Like you're, like if you go to sleep, like it's okay to go to sleep. The world's not going to stop, you know? Everything's going to be there tomorrow. Shit, my bad. I didn't mean to get so philosophical so early. Okay, um, doors on your left. It's the place with the sign up front. Yes, ma'am. Of course, you know where I go to. My treat. Do whatever you want. Alright, here we go. 